Hello everybody, um, welcome to this video. Now, if you asked me a week ago if I'd be making this video, um, yeah, I would have disagreed with you. However, I managed to find this 5800X3D on eBay as a new, opened, never used article. So, I stuck a bit in and uh, 255 quid delivered here it is now when it arrived it had a couple of bent pins here's a photo um, and instead of <laughs> probably a bad idea but instead of contacting the seller and sending it back blah 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 having to try and find another one I thought screw it I'll have a crack at straightening the pins so yep here's a photo of after I straighten the pins so now I plan to install this bad boy the first thing we're going to do is run some benchmarks um, not for a pre change post change um, example or anything like that this is just because it's a Ryzen processor and if you attempt to remove the cooler when they're cold <laughs> they probably will rip the processor out with it so I'm uh, I'll run a few benchmarks just to warm the bugger up and once it's done I will lay it down and uh, pull the graphics card out, pull the cooler off, stick this uh, 5800X3D in, and we will see what occurs. Now, now what's in at the moment is a 5800X. Um, it's been great. Um, I definitely didn't win the silicon lottery with it. Um, if I try and overclock it, it's yeah, it doesn't really like it. Um, but I'm all about the gaming and I'm all about the benchmark scores. So, 5800X3D for 255 quid. Here it goes. Boo! Right, so hopefully it's nice and warm. I'll stuck it on its back. I'll take the GPU out. Just, um, well, I'm just going to move it a little bit. <laughs> Good magnetic tip on these. Anyway, so I'm just going to pull this. Come on. Okay. So I was hoping to just pull it and leave the wires dangling, but uh, that's not going to happen. So. this oh come on oh oh that's painful oh yeah probably should have unplugged that first anyway MSI Radeon 6900 XT gaming Z triple um, otherwise known as the 6900 XTX. There you go. Let's fill the screen with it. She's a beast. Anyway, off with that. So, this is just held in with thumb screws. So, uh, there's one. There's the other. And hopefully, pull this wire out because. Oh wow, I got these in tight. Okay, right, I'm just gonna, just gonna go for it. Oop, and we're off. Fantastic. I trap these wires in as a means of, oh, come on. As a means of cable managing in whatever space I had. Looked great, but wow, it's difficult to get out. 
One moment, please, callers. Do, 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 So I'm going to give that a clean. In fact, I'll do that now before I do any damage with it. Yikes. One moment. There you go. Bit of kitchen roll. A little bit of window cleaner. Stuff's great. Give this. Wow. There's lots of thermal paste on there. I don't recall putting that much on. There we go. There we go. This is, uh, quite a lot of compound on there. It's the first time I've noticed that this isn't an overly flat and shiny block. Anyway, there is the CPU. Now, let's extract this bad boy. My faithful 5800X. Now, I know what you're thinking. Why go to the 5800X 3D now? And I'll be honest, when I built this machine, 5800X 3D was uh, coming soon. It wasn't wasn't on its way. So um, yeah, I'm pretty sure I can sell this for enough to make it dent in what I paid for the other one, so I'm just going to put this over here. I'm going to grab my new one now. When I received this, ooh, as I said, it had a few broken pins. Take a look at that bad boy now. Oh yeah. Hopefully, I've straightened it enough for it to... Uh, Drop straight on. There I was saying, hopefully, I've straightened it enough for it to drop straight in, and um, I think we can say that's in there, can't we? So, click that in. Now for my thermal paste um, from some recommendations uh, from an internet group I quite enjoy going on. Uh, custom gaming PC UK, something like that. Cool bunch of dudes. Anyway, they recommended this. So, uh, here we go. I am going to use the spatula approach for it as well. Because, well, have you seen that cold play? So, I'm going to stick a blob here. Boop. We're going to give it the spatula treatment. It's just an extra, I think it's an extra 60p it comes with a spatula. I mean, you can't go wrong. And I've done the P version, I've done the Make an X, I've, I've tried them all, I've not tried the spatula version. You know, just spread it all out before you put the CP, uh, CPU cooler on. Okay, um, obviously, none of the problems I had with my last. CPU can be attributed to poor thermal compound application because well, we saw when that came off that was uh, pretty thorough. So uh, here it goes. Last little corner. Well, I'm going to try not to do too much editing on this video. Like I said in one of my other videos, I like to keep it as real and raw as possible. Um, if you want to roast me for chucking too much thermal compound on, feel free in the comments. But uh, that was literally less than a pea-sized lump of thermal paste. And 
with the Adam spatula. It's bloody everywhere. I'm trying to get these last little bits, you know. You don't want anyone telling you you've not done your job properly. Not this is my job. Hell, I fix large machinery for a living. It's a miracle I can achieve any of some, any or some of this. <laughs> anyway, yeah, that's probably good enough. Pop that over there. Okay, CPU cooler. I'll chuck, I'll go for the bottom one first. Probably a dumb idea, but I'm going for it. I'm going to be like that. Yep, should have gone for the top one first. Right, top one too. Bottom one. Bottom one. What's going on here? Ah, I've got the wire stuck. Right. I'm sure this is perfectly safe for the CPU. Good job it's my CPU and not yours, eh? But to be honest, I'm not 100% confident this CPU is going to be okay. After what I found when I opened it. Um, so, uh, it does turn out to not work. It's going back to the cellar one way or the other, and I'll have myself a refund. Is it on there? Yeah, it must be on there. <laughs> Why isn't this going on? What's going on? Yeah. Managed to work its way out of the thumb nut. Let's try again. Oh, do come on. <laughs> yeah, big ham fisted sausage fingers. All right, let's go. We're on. Check. Make sure everything's just about tight. Okay, tuck these back in. Probably a dumb idea. Every chance I'm. Oh, hello. A little bit of damage to that wire. Okay, I'll deal with that later. Anyway, that's a CPU in. So. Oh, my next trick. <laughs> In goes this bad boy. Man, that's heavy. Now, by the way, if you want to, uh, if you want to do a video showing you around this absolute monster, um, let me know in the comments. More than happy. Uh, 5800X3D, 6900 XTX. Uh, X570 Tough Gaming 4266 megahertz RAM. I mean, it's uh, it's pretty beastly. Oh man, come on! Oh, yeah. Not there. I know I didn't practice this, but you know when you think you're going to do something, you think it's going to go wrong. Yeah. It goes in there. This goes in here. Click. Uh, somewhere, I'm expecting to stick a screw in. <coughs> oh. We're in. We're in, boys and girls. Marvellous. Now for... Where is it? There it is. Now for three. Eight 
and power connectors, one there. Right, I've got to stand this up. Oh shit, oh shit balls. Right, so the back's just fallen off. to avoid spilling my drink. Okay. Okay. Uh, let me just adjust the camera. Whoa, shit. Let me just adjust the camera. A little bit. Oh, and now my camera bracket is just broken. How could this get any better? Let me put the light on. Oop. There we go. So, <laughs> uh, you, uh, you may or may know, may or may not have heard my um, camera mount just exploded on me. So it's kind of sitting where it needs to be. And I still got that all because I still can't get that plug in. But there it goes. And one more. Come on, mate, you can do it. There we go. Right, those are all in. Screwed in, plugged in, CPU's in. What more can we do? Here goes. Tick, 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 tick. Come on, focus. Okay, there we go. So then let us BIOS pull the 5800 X3D. Consider how little memory is involved. Man, this takes a long time. 17 megabytes. 17 megabytes. Look at it. Off a of USB 3. Quite a fast one. Kioxia. Uh, yeah. When you consider it took 6 minutes to install Windows 11 on this machine a little while ago. Yeah, whatever. Anyway, back in a minute. Okay, well. Just as a, a quick test, because I'll be honest, it's, oh hell, it's um, 20 to 1 in the morning, I need to be at work tomorrow, so I'm going to have a quick blast on uh, Dead Island 2, because <laughs> it's funny, um, graphics are nice, currently pinned at 144 frames a second, and that is, um, in fact, I'll show you, if you go to options, go to display, um, you can go 144 or 240. Um, the screens are 165. So do I waste? Do I waste energy spunking out GPU power that I don't need? Um, no, I'm going to. I'm going 144. So, all right, let's rock. Uh, yeah, single player, whatever. Uh, I just want to play the damn game. Come on. Here we go. What a wonderful picture of a zombie with a knife in its eye. Hmm. F to enter. Oh, this is going to be a quick little mooch about. <laughs> These are fun. Uh, ba -ba -ba. Uh, 144 frames a second fixed as well. There. Hmm. Play it's always good. Yeah. Oh, I can't throw fuel over him. Ronnie got eaten. Shit. Well, it's dubbing not is not optimal on this, is it? <laughs> People who ain't like us don't last out here. Yeah, man. I told him, but he wanted to be the big fixer. <laughs> I got bit to fuck just keeping him alive this time. Right, so well, we've pinned 144 gun, frames. Let's get back to 97% right. GPU utilization, 100, uh, 302 watts, 64 degrees. <laughs> Ooh, hello. How you like me now, dumbass moaners? Oh. Shit! Every zombie in the neighborhood must have heard those screams. 
Find a window upstairs and shoot any motherfuckers coming into the backyard. Upstairs, the shoot motherfuckers. I'm in. I'm down for that. Okay, how do we get? Uh, uh, no, nope, can't go that way. That way. Okay, upstairs, upstairs, upstairs. Here we go. Upstairs. Where's that damn gun? I mean, come on. <laughs> Claws. Uh, what did I press? Uh, that one? Oh, cool. Not the one I wanted. Uh, yeah. Um, hello. Let's see what this baby can do. Uh, yep, opening it. Where's Better the damn gun? The Uh, yeah, really need the gun. Where's the... Oh, hang on. Right, uh... Aha! Uh, 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 yeah, boy! Boom, boom, boom. Anybody else with a comment? Haha! <laughs> Headshot! Ooh, yuck. <coughs> Hello. Boom goes the dynamite. Boom goes my boomstick. Sorry, not sorry, guys. <laughs> Certainly not sorry. Who else wants shooting? Oh, you. Aha. Boom. Pretty good. Who's this? Yeah. Hello. Ah, get off me. Right. Uh oh. Oh, that's not good. Come on, boys. Boom. Boom. Get off me. Who's puking at me? Yeah. Oh. That took you by fucking surprise. Yeah, fucking right. Yep. Yeah. Okay, I think I've achieved enough. Uh, let's go. Well. What can I say? Thank you all for joining in and sticking with me for, pff, I don't know how long this video goes on for. I'll try to cut it down a little bit. But, um, yeah, thank you. Thank you all. Hope you've enjoyed it.